My name is Sam and this is Kane Street. One of the things I love about Kane Street is not only do we talk about sports, but we also talk about politics. So I'm here on campus today to hear about the opinions of others. Should the United States have Meta World Peace become America's next ambassador to the United Nations? <laughs> I don't think he'd, he'd get much accomplished, man. Why isn't Brian Scalabrini on the ballot? You know, I ask myself that same question every day. With Mitt Romney attacking China and its economy, how do you think Jeremy Lin would react to that? Jeremy Lin's still going to score 50 points uh, for whatever team he plays for. So, If Obama does not win the election, does he have a starting role in the Charlotte Bobcats NBA team? Yeah, anybody can play for the Bobcats right now. <laughs> Even Mitt Romney? I don't know if Mitt Romney could play. Yeah, I don't know. White guys can't jump. How many sports teams do you think Mitt Romney owns? <laughs> Probably all of them. With so much popularity, should Shaquille O'Neal run for president in 2016? Well, Shaquille O'Neal is definitely a better choice than Mitt Romney. <laughs> How do you think Mitt Romney would do against Obama in a one-on-one -on -one basketball match? I don't know. I mean, there's a certain stereotype with basketball players. So everybody knows LeBron James. Everyone refers to him as King James. Do you think his monarchy is going to negatively affect the American government? What? <laughs> what? Um. <laughs> All right, so which of these candidates uh, for the presidential election is more influential? Barack Obama, Mitt Romney, or Kobe Bryant? Definitely Kobe Bryant. You know, I think he's really good on the defense. He's playing the point guard really well. And I think that his health care reform policies are really solid. Do you feel that Dwight Howard has political influences over, say, uh, Paul Ryan? If he does, then America's in a lot more trouble. <laughs> Why isn't Scalabrini on the ballot? Who? Yeah, I'm <laughs> lost. I'm sorry. Who is that? So we all know that Mitt Romney is trying to attack the Chinese economy. How do you think Jeremy Lin feels about that? <laughs> I have no idea how Jeremy would feel. I just want to be his friend, to be honest. <laughs> I would very much like to be Jeremy Lin's friend, too. So if Mitt Romney and Barack Obama were to scratch the third presidential debate and move towards a one-on-one -on -one basketball to decide the final battle between the two, do you think this is a good idea? And if so, who would win? Should Meta World Peace become America's ambassador to the United Nations? Yes. Since the NBA is, is such a huge market here in the United States, do you think that the presidential election should be run as an NBA playoff style? Yeah, there should be brackets and a lot of betting. Out of all these athletes, who do you feel is the most influential? Kobe Bryant, LeBron James, Paul Gasol, or Barack Obama? E. Derrick Rose. If Barack Obama does not become our next president, do you feel that he has a place in the Bobcats team? I feel like we should all move to Canada, so there won't be any basketball anymore. <laughs> I've learned a lot about what people think about the presidential election and the NBA. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Kane Street. I'm out. My name is Sam.